Good morning guys, my hair's kind of crazy. It's actually kind of windy today. Um, today is Monday, I'm at the train station. I'm on my way to London. I have a meeting this morning um, at nine o'clock, so it's quite early and hence my hair is a bit crazy because I just crazy rough dried it and kind of also half dried it. I didn't properly like dry the whole thing. So it's gonna be a bad hair day today. I'm sad it's Monday because I had, this train is going really, really fast. I'm so sad that the weekend is over. I had the best weekend with the kids and my sister it was so much fun but yeah back to London today and I have a busy one so taking you guys along with me let's see what happens I'm currently editing yesterday's vlog on the train and Lulu is so cute I can't even deal with it she's my favorite person in the world look how cute she is coffee acquired and London is looking particularly gray today here we go guys meeting number one this coffee is actually so good guys I think it's the best cappuccino I've had in quite a while it's from Peyton and Ben, which I think is a chain. I've never been there before, but this one was on Great Portland Street. So if you're ever passing, go and get a cappuccino. It's really good. I just got out of my first meeting, which on a side note went really, really well. I'm feeling very inspired today. Um, and I am now in Fort Lauderdale Mason, and I've come for a facial with Marie Reynolds, who I've had a facial with before, and she's amazing. I'm trying out um, a facial called the Master Lift, which has like, LED technology, which I've heard so much about. I'm traveling for the next few weeks, so I really want my skin to be like, looking good. So I'm gonna try that out, look like a crazy person, and then I have more meetings after that as well. Oh my God, the beauty department in Fort Lauderdale Mason is intense. And they have more, which is such a forgotten about brand, these little tins, and they have soap in them, but how cute are they? I had one ages ago and I loved it. They have this marshmallow scent, which is amazing. Guys, this is a great look. Are you ready for this? <laughs> This is Marie. Hello. <laughs> and she's gonna be doing my facial stand. This is before I have makeup on, so yeah, it's probably not gonna be quite as pretty afterwards. Oh, but we okay. shall see. Is it gonna be good? Am I gonna be glowing? Yes. I'm a bit scared. Apparently we're doing micro needling, which I know a few people have it done at the moment and they swear by it, so we shall see. I'm a little bit scared though. <laughs> Here we go guys, I can't see anything right now, but we're doing <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> I can't wait to watch this back. I think I'm gonna look slightly crazy. In case anyone is wondering what I'm doing and, and why, <laughs> why I'm putting LED lights on my face. Red is anti-aging, right Marie? Yep. Yeah. Blue is anti-inflammatory and antibacterial. And then the purpley violet one is like a bit of everything. So yeah, technical. <laughs> So this is the after guys, I'm feeling surprisingly non-red, which I'm excited about. But Marie also just did microneedling on my lips. And they're so much more plump and juicy, but it really stings. <laughs> That's the worst bit, I think. This is, okay, here's the before and after. Uh, can you tell the difference? This is so cool guys, look at this Alice in Wonderland. I, I don't even know what to call it, it's Alice falling from the sky in Fortnum and Mason's in the atrium. So cool! Oh my goodness guys, my skin feels amazing, although I am going makeup free. Looking a little bit shiny on the streets of London this afternoon. I'm on my way to my second meeting, which is hopefully a lunch meeting. I haven't actually had any breakfast today because I started so early and then I just never ate. I just never thought of eating and now I'm so hungry. So this is my lunch guys. We're at Head and Street Kitchen, which is really lovely. It was actually just been throwing it down with rain. It has stopped, thank goodness. But I got some muscles, so hungry, can't even tell you. So I'm now in the back of the cab on my way to get my brows done because my brows are in a bad way, guys. Like, I think I'm like a month late on getting them done. And I stopped into Zara, I had like 20 minutes in between my meetings. I ran across the road into Zara to get some new jeans because if you guys have followed me for a while, you may know my favorite jeans ever in the world are from Zara, but I always get like the similar pair. There's like two different kinds that I like. There's one with the biker zips and then there's another one with holes in it. So the ones with the zips are all worn out like on the seams because I wear them all the time. So a few of them like the seams have popped open and then the ones with the rips I've like put my foot through loads of times and the holes are getting bigger. So I picked up one of each of those before I go away. But I also found this, which I wanted to show you guys. I also picked up some stuff that I lent my friend. Um, really quickly because her office was just down the road but I also picked up this which is a biker jacket show I know it's kind of hard to see in here but it's got this amazing material look at this it's like all embroidered and it has like silver thread on the inside of the leaves and it's like a see-through jacket so I thought this would be really good for the summer but also for this trip because it's gonna be warm most of the places that I'm going so yeah 
Zara number, pick that up, I love it. I think it'll look really good with like a white t-shirt and like ripped jeans or whatever, just like really, really plain outfit, because it's quite detailed. So I just had a quick pit stop to have my brows done at the Blink Brow Bar in Notting Hill, and I think I've done a good job. I have so overdue on having my brows done, it was quite gross and really painful, you know, when you've got like way too much going on. Um, so yeah, I've just done that, and I'm now on my way back into central to what is going on here really it's like hardcore raining so my hair's just gone even more crazy i'm on my way back into central for my final meeting of the day before going home to see mike i'm also about to call my mum i haven't spoken to my mum in ages she's been away for the past few weeks so we've been like crossing over with each other like when she's away i'm home and then when she's home i'm away so it's been a bit of a nightmare so i'm gonna give her a ring and catch up that is about it for now. I've just gotten in my car and I'm on the way home to see Mike. I haven't vlogged in between the last taxi journey and now because I went for drinks and like my last kind of post, it's like a meeting, but not really. It was just kind of a catch up. Um, and who was sitting on the next table, but Robert Pattinson. I wanted to vlog, but it felt really rude. I feel like it's like a real invasion of privacy if you like film or take photos of someone when they're in somewhere like chilling out so i didn't want to but he was standing right there and like sitting like two tables up and omg he is as good looking in real life gorgeous it's chucking it down with rain now i'm on my way home to see mike can't wait it's been a long day i left the house just before seven so and it's now half past nine so yes i'm excited to be home oh here she is hello little one did you have a nice day i missed you did you have a nice day? Have you been a good girl? You monkey. Oh, la saucy soft. Hello there, beautiful girl. I miss you. This is basically what I have to deal with from this one. Face rape. Oh, in the mouth. No. Ah! What are you doing? <laughs> You are so cute. So cute. Are you doing? <laughs> this is filming you. Why are you filming me? Hi. Hello there. I was trying to zoom in then I realised I was pressing the wrong button. Working. What are you doing? Working. What are you doing? Saying hi. Hi. Hello. I miss you. About. about that much which is loads but unless it's great but watching football so boy time boy time How have you been finding this piggy very boring i say very boring you notice something different about me today you're wearing a leather jacket no that's pretty similar to most days isn't it black trousers pretty similar to most days Got a camera in your hand? That's also pretty similar to most days. Hair changed? Anything about me? Eyebrows sharper? Hood bruise? I, they're not HD, but I got them through. Oh, oh, don't and give me that. Can't even have do HD Do you notice anything days. about my face that's different? Like, than what I would normally have on my face if I went to London for the day. So it's going to be, it's a fast check. <laughs> Mike, actually, I don't have any makeup on. No. Oh. <laughs> I thought you'd gone and done something to yourself. My then. God, I had Botox. <laughs> I thought you had some kind of fillers of Botox. I was about to blow and go off on one. No, I don't have any, but I don't have any um, makeup on. Because I had a facial. I love that you don't notice. That makes me love you all the more. I also just got home to this giant bunch of flowers beautiful they're like huge i feel like it's probably 24 white roses and this is the envelope it's got my address on the inside but like there's no note there's actually no note i don't know who they're from there's some there's some from some flower food mike says it wasn't him was it you piglet was it you piggy <laughs> um so whoever sent these flowers, thank you. I don't know who it was to thank. I feel like there might be, maybe there's like a message. Normally there is a message, isn't there? But there's nothing like even stuck in, in the sides. I don't think I even have a vase big enough for these flowers. They're ginormous. So I've just got off a 10 p.m. conference call to New York 
my final <laughs> piece of work for the day and I totally forgot that Game of Thrones is on. Right now, we've missed it, we're like an hour and a half late. Luckily, Mike here is very organised and he has it on series link. Thank goodness and for Sky Q. Thank goodness that he's got a spangly Sky thingy that records it, which is like Netflix. What's it called? Sky Q. Q. I'm not very technical with my TV. But, Game of Thrones, Series 6, Episode 8. I'm missing Wheeler Dealer for you Here for we go, you are missing Wheeler Dealer. I missed you. I missed Independence you. Day. New, are you indep ready for New Independence Day. What? What New Independence that? Day. Is Will Smith in it? No. Will Smith's not in it. No. I'm not interested then. You haven't seen the trailer. <laughs> it's not a very good angle there. Are you excited for America? Don't tickle me. Are you excited for Vegas, baby? Vegas, baby! What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. <laughs>